So, Dragon Dogma 2 is coming out later this month. Uh, it looks to be one of the earlier contenders for Game of the Year 2024. And in anticipation for Dragon's Dogma 2, Capcom has, for some reason, uh, made a character creator and storage, which has its own separate page on Steam as a demo. And you're allowed to post reviews for this. So we're going to check these reviews out. I'm sure they're not crazy. That's a chunky boy right there. Anyway, let's go see. I like Dragon's Dogma 1, but it was a bold move by Capcom to make the sequel a character creator only. And free. Truly avant-garde. This dude put 12 hours into making characters for Dragon's Dogma 2. My brother in Christ, you literally have nothing else to do. Is it like, do you do anything besides like just physical aspects? It really looks like it's just physical. Granted, there do seem to be a lot of options, but my god, dude, come on. Come on. This character creator is so good at they make a full game on it. Yeah, they should just license this out to other game developers. Like, hey, you like our character creator? You can have it for like five grand. Thank you, Solid Snake. That's not Solid Snake, that's um, Naked Snake, or the balls. Big balls. Ah, I know Metal Gear, shut up. Height limited to 160 centimeters. I want my red-haired murder goblin back. I assume limited on the low end, because if you wanted to go higher, you really wouldn't call him a goblin. Also, how tall or short is that? It's apparently five feet and a quarter, which is not that good. If you like creating characters for games that aren't out yet, this is an absolute banger. You can customize the heck out of it, up to five origin and five main palm. Then you can get back to waiting until the game comes out. Now that I've created one of each type, I can feel myself waiting two or three times harder than I was before. Would recommend to anyone who wants to do everything you normally do right before starting an epic venture, then not start the adventure for two more weeks. It's, don't worry, you're going to get there eventually. Also... Also, if you truly like making characters, may I introduce you to Hero Forge, where you can just make minis, however many you like, and make them however you like, with so many different species, head, body, pose, everything. You, you can knock yourself out. Turtle person. Defeated the starting boss of Character Creator. It was a rough 10 hours, but I finally finished. It's not really a boss. It has boobs and butt sliders. 10 out of 10. <laughs> I am curious as to what your other reviews are, Mr. Wingus Dingus. This character creator plays longer than the whole Call of Duty campaign. What? <laughs> to face when the shortest possible character you can make is still three inches taller than you. Oof. Manlet detected or, or girlet, so opinion irrelevant. Minimum character height is 160. Literally cannot recreate my tiny warrior pawn from the first game. Disappoint. Yeah, wh where are the murder goblins? Where are the murder gnomes? Like, come on, game? Terrible. Human, check. Male, check. White, check. Warrior, check. Gamer time. Releasing a character creator prior to the main game is pretty genius. It also has 1,200% more active players in Suicide Squad. Is that still the case? Dragon's Dogma. 3,000. Suicide Squad. 800. God, this game is awful. <laughs> no lowly dwarf, halfway gnome goblin. No leg height modifier. Can it just hand feet sizes? Boobs can't be flat, can't be underweight or frail, can't make toned females, limited face presets, all faces are either boring or ugly, and everyone looks British, no proper Korean Japanese, no cute faces, no young faces, can't flatten nose bridges, can't manually adjust lower and upper lip separately, can't swap out individual face features with other scans, skin textures have a base color associated Reducing skin tones, no twin tail haircut, can't make Hatsune Miku. Removed a bunch of hair options from the original, took me two hours to create two decent looking characters, no actual gameplay demo. 
Oh my god. My god. I don't say this much, but, like, go touch some grass. Did they say there was gameplay in the demo? No, it is literally, it literally says Dragon's Dogma 2 character creator and storage. Like, why would you think it is a demo? I mean, sure, the, it says the demo tag right there, but that's just to get on the shop. Why would you think it has gameplay if it just says the character creator? Come on, now. I swear, internet people just complain about anything. Clowns out here reviewing this like it's a full game experience. I mean, you're in here too, dude. You are not free from sin. Thank you, Capcom, for saving me five hours on release. N now it's up to seven. Now it's up to seven. Wow, this this dude went in depth, in detail, about the character. I eagerly await your review of the game, Greed. Godspeed, and I... Uh, I love making a character for a game I can't run. Is that a joke because the game's not out yet? Or is that a joke because you don't think your PC is going to be able to run Dragon's Dogma 2? Oh, and you're... <laughs> you're Melania with cat ears. Oh, you can't even see it. Melania mm. with cat ears. Perfect. I can't wait to see you in Shadow of the Earth Tree. Booba slime me Slider gave me a tickle in my pickle. 10 out of 10. My dude, you should check out the NSFW tag. Best free game I've ever played. Can't wait for the $70 DLC. I mean, it did technically come out first. So if you want to get granular and technical about it, it is in fact going to be DLC. Bureaucrat Conrad, you are technically correct. The best kind of correct. 20 plus hours to make Virgil Let Let's check this thing out. Thank you, Lumen Psycho, 40 subs. Not bad. That that that's some um, that's some detail. God, some people have way too much free time. Can't wait to show my boyfriend that create a character that looks just like him in this game. Oh, and they made a little teddy bear. Look at this. They're holding hands. I want them dead. I can make a goth girlfriend. Post the link, dude. I need one. Well, time to check out the community hubs and check out other people's shit. Oh, look, it's Keanu Reeves. I think that's supposed to be him. Johnny Sil- Yeah, it's supposed to be Johnny Silverhand. Oh, my God. <laughs> Who is that? That's a cute- That's a very fucking detailed character. The Crow? The oh, my God. Fat, pa fat Panda. It's Kung Fu Panda? She looks so familiar. Fuck. Samuel L. Jackson. God, that really... Without the mutton chops, that really... The eyes really look like him. Good job. Ew. That looks like something from My Hero Academia. I don't fucking watch it. That's supposed to be Arnold Schwarzenegger. I, see, I don't really see it. Nosferatu Zod. That's a good Nosferatu Zod. Fucking Pinhead. I think that's his name. From the Hellraiser saga. Michael <laughs> Jackson. <laughs> uh, it's it's what what's his name? Oh, uh, Christian Bale. They made Ronnie. Handsome Squidward. Oh God, these are better than the Steam. They made what's your the girl, Clementine. Oh, that's the actual screenshot from fucking Walking Dead. That's supposed. I can see it a little bit, but yeah, it's all right. They made Kratos amazing. Any artwork to go along with this? More of the same. John Rambo. Let's go Rambo. That's a pretty good Makama. I'll give you that. Well, fuck it. Okay, that's, this video's dragged on long enough. Until next time, fuckers, bye.